gentlemen, this is Lavido Beats and today we're remixing Anya. I don't know if you heard about Anya, because Anya is actually one of the best paid songwriters in the world. She's Irish, she's living in a castle far away from here, and she's, I don't know, living the dream? You may know her from Lord of the Rings, because she made a soundtrack for Lord of the Rings, one of the series, and it was really awesome. Today we're remixing Sail Away, it's actually her biggest hit ever. My mother used to play this song when I was a child sleeping in the sofa and it made me all calm. Alright, so let's get it! Sample time! So the song is actually called Orinoco Flow, but they call it Sail Away because it's very known for the lyrics, the chorus, the hook, Sail Away. It wasn't hard to flip because she's actually singing it very well on the BPM. The BPM is 115 and only thing I did was transposing her voice a little bit. Minus 3 sounds like this. Drums! So usually I split the drums for everyone. So as you can see I have hat, kick and snare, the basic ones that you need. And they sound like this. Usually I put some EQing on it and some compressing, just very basic. But the most important thing about drums is that you have clear, fat samples. Alright? Voice sample! I couldn't resist adding some arcade voice sample to this. You might think like, huh, how is he doing, how is he placing that in there? But really, it fits so good. You're gonna hear it when I'm playing the whole mix in the end of this video. 808! Very important with 808 is that you add some compressing and side chaining, so when the kick plays, 808, Bounces lower, so it goes like percussion. Some simple Age of Empire percussion. I call this Age of Empire percussion because it sounds like the Age of Empires, Age of Kings sample when you were chopping wood. Crash! Only thing I can say right now about crashes is add some delay, reverb. That's it. Birds at dawn. For the intro, I just added some bird sounds. It's a sample that I found, you know. Very simple with some filtering on it. Lead! So my screen is black, the waves are black. That's because I was uh, freezing and then flattening the sound. What does it mean? It means transferring MIDI to audio, okay? In Ableton it's very easy. You do right click on the MIDI file, you do freeze track, and then you do flatten track, which will appear after freezing the track. And then you get the audio, all right? Added some EQing, some retro color on it, and it sounds like this. Open hi-hat. Open hi-hat number two. High leads. Reverse crash. To add some tension to the track, reverse crash is the way to go. Okay, now let's have a listen to the film mix. Here we go. 